here we are in the SP500 in 30 minutes. Here you remember in the last video you used to have here that double bottom here, that one here. I told you if it's getting broke into the long it's getting broke here. Look where you are now. If you just follow that last video, you will have you make very nice money. Now at that level where we are, we got here. Look with me. A very, very sharp uptrend here as you see it. And here in the top, you came, you connecting that one here with that one here. And you wait in the break where it's going to be. If we're breaking down here, you can enter a short. If we're breaking above here, you can enter a long. So let's start our lesson of today. By the way, before we even start, you, yes, you watching me now. Are you not yet subscriber? Why, my friend? Make sure to subscribe to our channel and turn bell notification on to receive all our latest updates and videos. It's not something hard. Just a subscribe button down. Click at that. Next to it, a bell. Turn it to all. So like that, when we put in a new video, you're going to be notified. Or you can even join our VIP Discord where we give in long-term signals in the SP500. Plus, we sell in pot options and cover calls if you are interested as you see it is it here may i show it to you you can join it from here it's not expensive it's only 10 bucks per month or you can join here the master if you are interested about crypto and the uh, stock and option by the way it left only two places for the master here if you are interested but for the stocks as you see it we're given here long term buying signals in the spy and voo plus we're selling cover calls and we're selling secure pots if you don't have that much of money we can show you even how to sell vertical spread pots and calls if you are interested the link is it down in the description of that video you done it welcome to the family Oh well, guys, as you see that the SP500 here today, he trying to break here that last high here, but the market couldn't break it here. We zoom it here and we see in those things what I'm talking about. Look at it here. He go back till that last high here, that one here, but couldn't break that last high here where we fall down. By the way, those past days, it's been Christmas. That, that way, we don't put in for you any video. So now here, where's the SP500 going? Well, now as we still going up, me as sell a pot here, as you see it. Sell a pot here. Look at the market, tell where it went. It's going to expire that week in Friday. I'm going to keep my premium. Fair enough. Even you can benefit from those things, people with us. that We buying SP from down here. As you see it, tell where, where we are now. Even you can benefit from those things. Now what we got here in four hours, same thing, nothing was changed. We got here, that up trend here. As you see it, we've been touched thousands of times here. Now for us to enter a short, it needs at least that trend line to be broken. For us to think of maybe the market is going to reverse in that time, we're going to start selling cover calls. But at this time, us we just selling pots those days. And I think the market is going to give us a new high till the Fed started cutting interest rate. Because if you go and you watch in historical when the Fed is cutting interest rate, it always the market it falls down. That's why me I told you guys to join us to benefit from our analysis. Now let's see our indicator retain. Our indicator, guys, you remember that divergence us we show you here before, as you see that the divergence as we show you before here here in the chart from that peak here and that one here and down here from that one and that one we just came to touch it here now let's see if we're going to touch it here then the market is going to fall down or no Should we enter a short now not yet there is nothing here in the chart telling us us we need to enter a short so us we still waiting what the market is going to tell us in the coming days we got here now a very very clear megaphone but me i'm not going to wait until the megaphone if it's breaking if it's breaking just that trend line here i'm going to enter a short but then picture is too clear guys here now let's going to see the coming news of today Okay, so let's go in there. Before we go to see the coming news, we need to read that article here. As you see it, Reuters, they said US stocks extend their rally on Tuesday. 
kicking off the final week of 2023 with expectation that the Federal Reserve will begin cutting interest rate as soon as March. That what also we saying the market did go back to that last high. So there is nothing here to read about. I just tell you all those things before. I was going to see the coming news of today. Coming news of today, guys. As you see it, we don't got nothing here. Everything here. Market is closed. As you know, all those things. Here is our friend, the table of us as we look looking at it every day look at us market was it doing today everything is green that's very good news but you need to be careful because of that divergence i'll just show you down here our friend the vex as you see it today fall down it's break the 13 as we used to talk about we are 12.99 Parents currency is still very very low so there is nothing to be worried about the only thing if you are an option trader premium they are very very low those days because of the VIX and the volatility is very low so everything is in front of you here now it's going to see the SP500 we're doing today in 30 minutes so it's going there here we are in the SP500 in 30 minutes. Here you remember in the last video you used to have here that double bottom here, that one here. I told you if it's getting broke into the long, it's getting broke here. Look where you are now. If you just follow that last video, will that you make very nice money? Now at that level where we are, we got here, look with me, a very, very sharp uptrend here as you see it. And here in the top, you came, you connecting that one here with that one here. And you wait in the break where it's going to be. If we're breaking down here, you can enter a short. If we're breaking above here, you can enter a long. So I think picture is very, very clear in front of you. There is nothing uh, hard or something. Just wait in that break where it's going to be here or here, guys. Now let's see our indicator we're saying. Our indicator, guys, I bring you today that one because we got here a very, very clear divergence here, as you see it. You came, you connecting that one here and that one here. You got here a very, very clear divergence. Should we enter a short? I just show you. That one here, you came, you connecting those tails down and you wait in any candle to come to close below that level here. Yes, you can enter a short. Take profit, it needs to be just low here at that level here as you see it. But then picture is too clear, guys, here. Now it's going to see the Nasdaq 100 was doing today. So it's going there. Here we are in the Nasdaq 100, guys. Here the Nasdaq 100, same thing like the SP500. It came here to that last high. It touched here before that falling down here. And I give you the reason why it happened that sell off there. I told you because one strategy is named bed and breakfast. They use it people to avoid paying taxes. I told you all those things. Now here, it's not yet breaking that last high. Should we enter more long? At least it's need to break that last high if you want to enter long but me i don't advise no one to enter long now because also now we are in the top of the market for the short it's need the market to fall down to break that up trend line here as you see it need at least the market to fall down to break here for you to think in off to enter a short i think picture is too clear here now it's our indicator we're saying our indicator guys same thing we got here the divergence we are talking about before as you see it from that peak here that one here and that one here as you see got a very very clear divergence should the inter short not yet it's need at least the nasdaq 100 to fall down to break that uptrend here for us to enter a short if it doesn't happen there is no entry short and also we need to wait till the right time guys i think picture is very very clear here now it's going to see the nasdaq 100 was doing today in 30 minutes so it's going there here we are in the nasdaq 100 in 30 minutes guys here same thing like the sp500 look at it that uptrend here as you see it it's need at least that one here to be broken here that one here it's need to be broken either up here for us to enter a long or to be broken down here for us to enter a short if it doesn't get in broke there is no entry long no entry short another thing very very important here let me show it to you is it that one here same thing you got here a divergence here as you see it level you are in a very very stronger level shall you enter short if it fall down and breaking down here that uptrend here in 30 minutes you can enter a short that's just for day trading guys i think picture is too clear now it's going to see dex y or us dollar we're doing today so it's going there here we are in the DEX, why or US dollar guys? Here, same thing. You remember when me I told you it's breaking for us that double top here, it's breaking the neckline here, and I told you it's going to fall down till it's hitting the lower of that channel here. As you see it where we are. 
it's still falling down till it was touching down here now at that place what shall we do shall we think and off to enter long no my friend there is nothing here telling you the xy is going to reverse upward so as we still wait until we got a very very clear price action till now we don't got nothing and as we still waiting guys but the only thing you can do now just wait the xy you don't got nothing here telling you you need to enter along as we still in a very very sharp downtrend as you see it everything is too clear now let's see our indicator we in our indicator as you see it guys is it down here at the oversold area level a little bit it needs at least to touch here the downtrend here shall we enter long tell no we don't got no price action here telling us us we need to enter long so the xy is going to continue more down guys there is nothing new here but the picture is too clear now it's going to 30 minutes to see what the xy or us dollar doing today so it's going there here we are in 30 minutes guys over here is only for scalping and day trading here look at that double top here that one here i showed it to you before it's breaking the neckline here it meant that one here maybe it's going to fall down more another thing now you are in a very very stronger level here in 30 minutes me i'm talking about last time from here it jumped up now it touches again should we think into enter long not yet may i show you before here that's head and shoulder here as you see it but it doesn't break in the neckline which is here that one here it doesn't get in broke here for us to enter along so now same thing here we need to wait in the market to give us here a price action you know we don't got nothing you can make something like that same that neckline here and you waited to get broke here for you to enter along for the short now you are in a very very stronger level or less if it's break it more down and go more down but the picture is too clear now let's see our indicator where it's in our indicator guys as you see it is it down here at the oversold area so technically we need to look into enter long but not yet may i think until it will fall down to touch here that yellow line there and from there we're going to think to enter long at this time there is nothing here in the dx why so that's it for that video guys and please make sure to support us by just smashing the like button writing down a comment and if you could even share the video you done it thank you very 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 much my friends see you in another video guys bye for now